Even in Omaha Abbey State, the Fulani headsmen are not relenting in being problematic and troublesome. Here is a whole cattle grazing on this poor lady's farmland. She is helpless as they trample upon her cassava and her plants, and all she can do is boo at them and curse at them. And the headsmen are not in the least bit bothered. They're happily grazing. You can see the cattle mowing down the plants, mowing down the cassava and other plants in the farm, going even deeper into the farmland. Even though the farmland is fenced off, they still find their way in and graze. It, it's disheartening that things like this should happen uh, in the hearts of Abbey State and Omaha, the state capital. It's really sad that uh, with all the wasteland or all the fallow land around Abbey State that uh, the Fulani headsmen should choose to graze their cattle and farmland. As you can see, the poor woman, an older woman, is t thoroughly frustrated. But there's nothing she can do except to yell and curse. But we do hope that this video finds its way to the right ears and that something is done to curtail the excesses of Fulani headsmen. Um, this is not good. This, this, is not, this is not a good thing. And this is something that happens everywhere. It's happening in Omaha. This is Omaha, Abia State. So if it can happen here, it can happen everywhere else. And it seems like there's nothing anyone can do about it. The Fulani headsmen seem to be the new holy terror of uh, every community. And they graze wherever they want, whenever they want, however they want. And no one does complain. Because if you complain, the next thing, your family, your entire family will be butchered. Like it has been happening in Benue State. But um, it's disheartening that it should come to Abia. So I hope someone sees this and something gets done about it.